hey guys staffs welcome to my youtube channel i'm excited to have you here so in this tutorial i want to show you five amazing tools that will literally help you clone your website online without downloading any software this is literally online some of them are free some of them are paid so i'll walk you through all of them for you to see how this works so first on my list if you have been following me for a while you'll not be surprised it's called save web to zip and you can see that here so these two will literally help you clone any website online all you have to do is just paste your url here and hit the save button here if you do that it would save that website but the not too good part of this is that it is not a complete clone it will still link back to the live website so for example uh let's say that we want to clone a website called dabsbook.com that's my website so i think i have to copy this url and then let's copy and then let's hit save uh, let's close this so as you can see this just downloaded this into my laptop and that's how super simple it is but it will just clone the home page alone and then the menu button will link back to the live website so you would not have a complete clone so as you can see this is ready so that's not too good part of this one so the next on my list here is uh the wayback machine downloader so these two will literally also help you clone any website online and it would give you for offline viewing so a complete this is a complete clone however it's not free but it has its free version the free demo we just clone the first four pages so if you are trying to clone a single page website then you're lucky this tool will just give you that complete clone for free uh, anything outside of four pages would require that you pay $15 for you to be able to have a full download. So let's experiment with that again. Let me plug in my URL here. And let's just, yes, I am not a robot. So I'll just hit the download button. So yeah, scripting has started so we can check the progress here. So as you can see, this is literally just scraping our website this would keep going on and on and on so for you to see your latest results you need to refresh the page at every point in time so as you can see here this is literally done four pages free demo limit so it's completed so you can see these are the four pages that has been cloned for free so if you come down here you can download that so you have those four pages and you can see the installation guide this will point you in the right direction how to install this on a live server and you can buy all of them for just $15. You have the HTML website, you have the HTML template of that for just $15. So the next on my list here is called BFO tool. Literally the same thing like the save web to zip. Uh, it will give you free uh, download as well. So you can start processing. However, it is limited, give you the home page alone, just like save web to zip and also it will link back to the live website so that's how these tools will work so you can see this is done this is just downloading you can also click this download button and that's it so you can see this is done too as well so the next on my list here is called sitepuller.com uh, so this is another fantastic tool that will help you literally clone your website so you can come down here you can paste your website link here and you can just add an email a random email once you are done here you can hit the start button and then this would clone your website literally to give you a complete clone but then it's paid you would have to pay 9.9 .9, just literally like ten dollars for you to be able to have that complete file so final one is called themematcher.com and i love this tool but however there are some limitations to trying to use this instant wordpress theme that matches your website too. this is not just going to help you clone your website to html it will give you an instant wordpress theme that matches your website that's quite awesome it's a paid tool uh, but i would show you so if you paste your website url here as usual you can just hit create theme and just in a few seconds you can see your live website here so it will tell you select your wordpress area i don't know why this is compulsory this should have been optional in my own opinion i don't want to waste so much time on this so i will just want to select a, web, a wordpress area literally is called a blog area i also have a blog here so i might not just want to use this so that's why i feel this should be an optional tool 
I know opinion boy if I scroll down I can just find the place on this website that I want to use so if I click this I can just come next uh, no sidebar next uh, I can just say create theme that's it so in some few seconds this will be done so as you can see bingo that's it and your WordPress theme is ready so it says preview I have noticed the bug also with this that it would not show you the live preview i have reached out to the developers hopefully they will fix this i have done a tutorial before about this tool uh you can see a link on the screen right now and also i will maybe drop that in the video description i'll also be doing more tutorials hopefully about this tool and then the next thing you want to do here is just to download this theme and you can see it's a 47 dollars price tag on that theme but i think it's a money worth uh investing on if this tool will literally just do what it says it would do so like i said you can check my previous tutorial on this i'll also hopefully be doing more tutorials around this tool and that's it I hope you can check them out and then you can experiment with them and let me know your experience let me know which one is your favorite if you are not willing to invest money trying to clone your website just you just want it to have just want to have it for offline viewing then i would recommend that you install a software ht track or sciotech i have those tutorials you can check them in the video description if you simple tutorials for you to install and then you have them ready that's my time for this tutorial i hope it has been useful if it has give me a thumbs up if you have any issues let me know in the comment section if you have further tutorials you want me to make let me know in the comment section. and finally as well if there's any tool you have used online to clone or any form of website mirroring let me know in the comment section i'll be excited to know more about that and also check that out and that's my time i'll see another one until then stay safe